Hope you were able to spring forward this morning as our clock should forward to begin daylight saving time. As we head into this upcoming work week, we're going to see a few showers for us overnight tonight. Mainly clear for the first half of the night, but then as we go into the early morning hours by 8 a.m., we'll see some cloud cover and a few light showers across the area. A little bit stronger storms, maybe some thunderstorms up toward Haleyville and uh, into northwest Alabama. Otherwise, we're just going to deal with a few showers for Monday morning. Those will clear on out, though, and by the afternoon hours, we'll see some clearing skies and temperatures will continue to warm on up. We'll be in the upper 70s, approaching that 80 degree mark for us tomorrow afternoon. We will certainly hit that 80 degree mark as we go into the day on Tuesday. A few clouds to start the day, but by the afternoon hours, plenty of sunshine. We'll see those 80s, even the mid 80s, are pushing the upper 80s and 90 degrees for some in our southern counties for us Tuesday afternoon. By the evening hours, we'll see a few clouds off to our north and west. Those may produce a shower or two during the overnight hours, but otherwise we're going to stay dry until Wednesday afternoon when we start to see a few showers pop up, mainly for the south uh, portions of the viewing area south of I-59 as a weak cold front pushes through. Now this cold front will only bring a few showers in for us on Wednesday, but it's looking like it's going to stall out or even wash out to our south, which could mean that we would be seeing some more showers and storms as we head into the latter half of the work week. Overnight tonight, a few showers during the early morning hours as those clouds thicken during the overnight. 57 degrees for our low temperature winds out of the south at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tomorrow, expect temperatures to be warm. We'll see highs in the upper 70s for us tomorrow afternoon. Again, some of us like Montgomery and Demopolis could be sitting in the low 80s by tomorrow afternoon. Again, we could see a few showers in the early morning hours, but other than that, we'll be in the clear out, and we'll see plenty of sunshine as well for us on Tuesday. Warm and breezy, 86 for, the, for that high temperature here in Tuscaloosa. A few isolated storms and showers work their way back in for us on Wednesday. St. Patrick's Day, similar to what we see on Wednesday. I think the best chance will be across South Alabama, but we could see a few storms make their way back into Central Alabama on Thursday. Another system makes its way toward us on Friday, and that will bring us better chances for rain and a little bit cooler of temperatures. We'll see highs in the upper 60s by then, and that continues into the weekend as well with a few showers and storms on Saturday and cooling into the first day of spring on Sunday as high temperatures only warm up into the low and mid-60s.